Yes, so I'm uh, Johnny Moore, or Firefighter Moore. Uh, I work here at uh, Hemel Hempstead Fire and Rescue Station at uh, Hertfordshire Fire and Rescue Service. I applied for um, Northern Ireland Fire and Rescue Service, went through the full application process of that, flew over, did some interviews, the physical tests over there. And I really wanted to, to join over there because of my granddad. He was the inspiration of me um, joining the fire service. So he was a, a firefighter during the troubles. So he, he, he rescued me once uh, and that was my inspiration. Um, so yeah, didn't get into there. Got rather quite sad about that. And then um, two days later, after my rejection letter, I had the practical tests here. You learn quickly um, the standards that they set here and that you have to abide to those standards and just constantly learn. And if you make a mistake, like it's not the end of the world. Like I put on a smoke detector the wrong way, but I learn from that and I can then always take that with me. You, do, you make mistakes to improve. You can never be as prepared as you'd like to be, but you have to use the people around you, the older, older pe people on the watch who have experienced it all. So I'm brand new, I've only not even done a year yet, yet we've got people on this watch that have done over 20. And learning from them, they were just unbelievable coming in uh, when I first joined. Uh, even when I didn't want to do anything, they'd be like, right, let's get a piece of equipment, let's just learn this. And it really fills you with confidence the fact that they want to help you and push all of their knowledge onto you so that you can then work well as a team together, but also so that for us, they're doing it for us, for our development, so that we can be the best that we can be. I'll take you back right to, to school where I just played a lot of sport. That's all I did. I went to school to socialize, to play football at break, to play football at lunch. There was this one period of time uh, I think it was year 10 or whatever, and I got badly injured. I was out for like nine months. And I really realized how important sport was for my mental health there because, yeah, I got into, I got into trouble back then at school, which I'd never had because I could release all the energy and everything playing sport. Whereas when I was injured, I was in school just causing trouble because I was bored and I was angry, frustrated. So I'd be cheeky, uh, just mess around, not do any of the work, couldn't be bothered. Because I was literally just upset that I couldn't play sport. So for me, say I've been on a bad job, or whatever, I can just take my mind off of it by go home, play with my friends there at home. Like you just you're just laughing for no reason. You're talking about absolute rubbish, and it just helps you like detox your mind in a way. I I really like helping people, and I find it difficult when you leave a job and you can't then provide even more help. Doing physical exercise and sport really takes your mind off that. And oh, I couldn't suggest it enough. And just having people to talk to as well, or finding something for you that works to just switch the mind. So video games, uh, anything, reading books. Like, yeah, I've started reading books again as well. Uh, not very good at reading, but it's just a great way to indulge yourself in something that's so make-believe that it's kind of cringy but like really great to just switch your mind away. Well.